Hi, I'm Amy Knutson, water quality specialist for the City of Cedar Rapids. Your Cedar Rapids water team works around the clock to ensure clean, safe, great tasting water makes its way reliably to your home or business. For some properties built before 1971, there is a risk of lead in your tap water. We constantly monitor for lead at the water treatment plants. We even add a safe treatment additive to protect you from dissolved lead in your tap water, which usually comes from old pipes or fixtures. We are working hard to identify old service line materials in some homes and businesses with older water connections. Our goal is to remove any historical lead service line connections over time. The service line is the connection between our water main in the street and the water meter in your home. The city owns a portion of this service line between the street and your property line. You own the rest of the connection between your property line and the meter. You can help us update our service line inventory by identifying your service line type. Today we'll walk through a few simple steps to determine what type of service line you have. You can report your service line material online at cityofcr.com inventory. The first step is to locate your water meter. Water meters look like this. Water meters are often located in a basement, crawl space, utility room, or garage. Once you've found where the service line enters your property, through the wall or the floor, you'll want to perform a visual inspection of the service line type. Here we have various types of service line connections. We have lead, galvanized, or copper. Copper is usually bronze in color. However, it can become a brownish green color over time through the oxidation process like an old penny. Galvanized service lines can look like fresh galvanized steel, look dull over age, or begin to look rusty. Lead service line pipes are usually a dull gray in color. Sometimes these service lines can be covered in paint. That's okay, because we are going to perform a scratch test to determine our service line type. When performing the scratch test, it is helpful to scratch the pipe as close to the connection to the floor or wall as possible. Some pipes may have been extended with a newer material connecting between the service line and the meter. It is important we understand the type of service line coming in from outside your building. So you'll want to perform the scratch test as close to the outside of the building as possible. You do not want to perform the scratch test on the portion of the pipe that connects to fixtures inside your home or business. Perform the scratch test on the portion of the pipe coming in from outside the building. Now, use a dull surface like a quarter to perform the scratch test. You do not want to use a sharp surface like a knife. Simply scratch the surface of the pipe very gently like this. This is shiny and bronze in color. It is copper. Next, we'll perform the test on our galvanized. Most galvanized will look like this found in your home. Once again, use your dull surface and lightly scratch to reveal underneath the surface. This is a dull gray in color. This is galvanized. Another way to tell is by using a magnet, like from your refrigerator. If the magnet attracts itself to the pipe, you will know the pipe is not lead, it is galvanized steel. Let's try this pipe. Once again, we'll scratch the surface. Use your dull surface to scratch the top layer off and reveal the underneath surface. You can see that this is shiny underneath. This indicates this is a lead pipe. Another way to check is with our magnet test. You'll see how the magnet falls right off and is not attracted to the pipe. Once again, that indicates this is a lead service line. Now that we have identified our service line type, we're going to take a photo of the water meter and service line to send to the city of Cedar Rapids. If you have a smartphone, you can fill out the survey right on your phone. It makes submitting a photo easier. 
When you take the photo, try to frame it like this, so the meter and connection to the service line is clearly visible. Make a note of your property address and service line type. If you feel uncomfortable with performing the scratch test or aren't sure you've properly identified the service line type, call the City of Cedar Rapids. We can schedule an appointment to come to your home and perform a service line inspection. For more information, visit the City website. Thank you for helping the City of Cedar Rapids keep your water clean, safe, and great tasting.